One thing that I've run into a lot is that a teacher or a professor will assign me a video to watch that's maybe two hours long. Now, that's a pretty sizable chunk of time, but there's a really efficient hack that you can do to make sure that you're watching these videos much faster, and that's getting a video speed controller. Basically what this does is this allows you to speed up your videos to two, to four, or even 16 times as fast. Now I don't watch it at 16 times as fast, but I do watch it at four times as fast, which means that a two hour video becomes a 30 minute video. Now, you can do this by default on YouTube, but it only lets you go up to 2.5 times as fast, and it only works in YouTube. So what I've done is I found this Chrome extension that helps me do it on most videos on the internet, and also that works specifically at a faster speed. I hope you'll stick around and we'll jump right in. Okay, so let's say we have this YouTube video and we want to speed it up. So it's Hi, playing. My name is Jackson. But we want to speed it up. So you can go to the little gear icon and then go to speed and then change the speed to two times. And that's as fast as it'll let you go. Today I want to show you how to listen to anything on your Mac computer for free. Now that sounds pretty fast, but in all honesty, to me, that's actually pretty slow. So the way that we solve this real quick is that we just go to another Google Chrome tab and we go to video speed controller. We click on that. And it will bring you to this extension. And all you do is you just click Add to Chrome. And you hit the Add extension. And again, we don't take any legal responsibility for anything you add to your computer. <clears throat> and now it's been added to Chrome. So you have to refresh the page. And you'll notice this little Hi, thing up here. This little thing allows you to change the speed that your video plays at. So let's say we want to go all the way up to three times speed. So now, real quick before we move on, um, I, I just want to show you a few other things that you're setting the speed. First of all, so what it does is so there are some shortcuts. Here, so increasing to, the speed um, is S and is decreasing the speed, speed so my default is D. Is so S and D make sense because they're right next to each other on the keyboard. The preferred speed. And so then resetting basically the speed this is your default. R. You know, at, when you start the thing up, it'll it'll be at 2.5 times speed. So if I let's see, if I save this, that. And then I go back and I close this window and I refresh this page. So watch. If I'm playing it and I hit G, then it goes up to 2.5 times speed. Now, there are a few things that may come as a problem for you. So first of all, um, you may be in another browser and I believe there is a equivalent on Firefox and there is something similar that's not the same program but that also works in Safari. Um, I'll probably leave some links in the descriptions of that, for that as well. But there are also videos I've noticed, say, on, I think, certain government websites that don't um, use video speed controller. And the reason that that is is because those are actually um, not HTML5. So there's two primary ways that people upload videos or p videos are played on online. Um, one is HTML5, which is most YouTube videos will allow you to use HTML5. But there's also Adobe Flash, which is different, and those don't get affected by Video Speed Controller. Um, I did a while back have this program called Announce My Speed, but it stopped working with Google Chrome. So if you do find a solution to that, let me know. And if you also have videos that you're just having trouble watching, let me know and I'll see what I can do. Maybe I can find uh, another service that will allow you to increase um, those Flash videos to HTML5 or just make them faster. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you'll like and subscribe and comment and also share this video with anyone you think might need it. I'll see you next time.